Hey, it's Mike from the Mike Wagner Show. Thanks for tuning in to the Mike Wagner Show on Anchor FM. If you're interested in sponsoring my show, you can send me an email to the Mike Wagner Show at gmail.com, or you could also donate to the uh, podcast. Just go to the Donate Listen site, and um, you can also donate whatever you like. Anchor is the easiest way to make a podcast. For those who are interested, Anchor can give you everything you need in one place for free, which means right from your phone or computer. We've got creation tools. allows you to record and edit podcasts so it sounds great. And those distribute the podcast for you so you can be heard everywhere. Spotify, Apple, Google, many more. And you can make money from the podcast with no minimum listenership. So download the Anchor app for free or go to Anchor FM to get started. It's now time for the Mike Wagner Show. Powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. The Mike Wagner Show brings you famous celebrities and amazing people from all over the world. Listen online at themikewagnershow.com and on Facebook, SoundCloud, Spreaker, Spotify, and iHeartRadio. And watch the interview on YouTube. So sit back and relax and enjoy the Mike Wagner Show. Hey everybody, it's Mike from the Mike Wagner Show, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all you need. Look at a professional website without breaking your budget. Sonic Web Studios is the answer. Sonic Web Studios offers fast, affordable custom web designs that blow the competition away. Call today at 1-800-303-3960. That's 1-800-303-3960. Or email to support at sonicwebstudios.com. Mention the Mike Wagner Show. Get 10% off your first order. Sonic Web Studios. Take your image to the next level. Also, The Mike Wagner Show can be heard on themikewagnershow.com. You can check our Facebook page at facebook.com slash themikewagnershow. You can download and listen on Facebook, SoundCloud, Spreaker, Spotify, and iHeartRadio. Also on Anchor FM, Radio Public, iTunes, Google Play, and Apple. Also on Stitcher Podcast as well, too, and other podcasts coming soon near you on The Mike Wagner Show. Also, take The Mike Wagner Show with you on any mobile device and subscribe to The Mike Wagner Show on the YouTube channel. We're here with a wonderful lady from Pittsburgh, PA. She was born and raised outside the area, began singing at a very young age, started guitar at 16, and she has um, a soon-to-be release, um, Never Say Never, and featuring the hits, soon-to-be hit single, Medicine, and a lot of influences. We'll uh, talk about that, and um, of course, we'll be asking um, you know a little bit of questions as well, too. So right with us on the Mike Wagner Show, live from beautiful Pittsburgh, PA, the home of the Pirates and the Penguins, and, of course, um, Steel City, and just chilling out with some gold country, Ashley Puckett. Ashley, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Thanks for joining us today. <laughs> Hello, how are you doing? Hey, I'm doing great. So you're born and raised outside Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. You began singing at a young age, star guitar at 16, and you've got uh, a soon-to-be release with a couple of uh, singles as well, too. And uh, before we get into all that, uh, tell us how I got started. Yes, um, well, actually... Uh... I've been singing what I say is all my life. So I think I, I started singing my first song. It was around the age of five. Mm-hmm. Um, so since then, it was kind of just nothing I had to think about. It was just something that was casual, something I kept in my life all the time, something I was just happy and enjoyed doing. And then, um, you know, as I grew older, I just figured, you know, enjoying something that much. I think that's what you need to be doing um, for your career and your life. And uh, I met the right people and. Here I am, and we have our first single out, and it's doing pretty well. So I'm excited. That's amazing, too. And what's the one moment that got you into um, singing and guitar? What's the one precise moment? I think the one moment is when I realized that I enjoyed it so much that there wasn't going to be a point in my life that music wasn't going to be taking precedence over anything else. And at that time, um, I started playing guitar at 16 which kind of helped out the songwriting, uh, made that a lot easier for me. And it was probably around 16 or 17 when I realized that I think music was going to be um, pretty important and I think the way I was going to go with my life. Mm-hmm. That's interesting, too. And who are some of your favorite singers and um, guitarists uh, growing up as well? Uh, there's so many of them. Um, I look up to as far as, you know, some of the music I like to sing, some of those who has kind of shaped me as artists, like Leanne Rimes, Miranda Lambert, um, Carrie Underwood, Patsy Cline. Um, growing up, I loved Joe Nichols. Um, there's just so many great ones. Those are just a few. Mm-hmm. It, it sounds like country is pretty much uh, a big influence in your life as well, too. And uh, who are some of your favorite guitarists um, growing up? Um, you know what? I, I've never 
really picked one or the other out. Um, as far as when I play, um, it's, you know, a little bit here and there. I've never um, geared one way or another. It's just always been, as long as it's country, I listen to it. <laughs> uh-huh. And, 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 I have, and I have to say, too, that that's pretty much the um, big thing as well, too. And we'll talk about your um, your upcoming um, release as well, too. You listen to The Mike Wagner Show at themikewagnershow.com, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit that online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. Look at a professional website without breaking your budget. Sonic Web Studios is the answer. Sonic Web Studios offers fast, affordable, custom web designs that blow the competition away. Call today at 1-800-303-3960. That's 1-800-303-3960. Or email to support at sonicwebstudios.com. Mention the Mike Wagner Show. Get 10% off your first order. Sonic Web Studios. Take your image to the next level. Also, the Mike Wagner Show can be heard on the MikeWagnerShow.com. You can check our Facebook page at Facebook.com slash the Mike Wagner Show. You can download and listen on Facebook, SoundCloud, Spreaker, Spotify, and iHeartRadio. Also on Anchor FM, Radio Public, iTunes, Google Play, and Apple. Also coming soon to Stitcher FM. Also take the Mike Wagner Show with you on any mobile device and subscribe to the Mike Wagner Show on the YouTube channel. We're here with country singer Ashley Puckett, born and raised outside Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. She began singing at a young age, started guitar at 16, and she's got a soon-to-be-released um, album coming out called Never Say Never, featuring the hit single Medicine. And uh, let's talk about your album and uh, how you got started. Yes, um, so Never Say Never, it's going to be a 13-track album. Um Never Say Never is one of my favorites on there. Um, I have a few. They're all very meaningful in different ways. Um, medicine was chosen as, you know, the front line. Um, it's just a very raw, beautiful, simple song um, to kind of set the stage. Uh, a lot of the songs uh, you'll learn from me is um, romance and love stories is kind of my favorite. Um, but there's a lot of different things in, in there, too. I think there's going to be something, a uh, song for everybody, even if you're not. 100% into the country genre um, mm. that, you know, everyone's going to enjoy. Mm -hmm. and, and you talked about, uh, you know, having 100% country that um, is part of your album as well, too, and also part of the genres. And uh, what are some of the other genres that you feature in your album as well? I think um, in some of the songs you can hear a little bit of blues uh, with my voice. I think it, it runs pretty smoothly you know, bluesy country style, um, a little bit of pop too, um, just to be a little bit more modern, um, and appeal to, uh, you know, a few different audiences. Mm -hmm. And how would you classify your music? I would still classify it as country, modern country. Mm -hmm. and, and do you think it has like more of a classic tone, a semi-moderate, moderate, or, or like an up-to-date pop sound? How would you describe that particular? I would probably say um, moderate, maybe to a little bit more classic. Um, some of the um, musical stylings, we've tried to modernize a bit. Um, but I, you know, personally, I grew up on my favorites being more classic country, not so much pop country. So I tried to stay true to, you know, what I like to sing personally. Mm -hmm. and you mentioned uh, Patsy Cline in your, um, in, in the musicians that influence you um do you have any songs or like um any like say um remakes of patsy klein do you plan on doing in the future uh potentially i've uh, i've always been a fan of crazy that's one of my favorites to play live um so maybe that could be in the future sure okay also yeah that song medicine as well too and uh tell us some more about that medicine is one of those songs that touched me as soon as i heard the song play um, it was actually one of the one or first or second songs that I heard that I just knew absolutely had to be on the debut album, um, just because it's so simple and the melody kind of just pulls you in, no matter you know what your thoughts are. It, it's obviously a song, a love song about having that one person that's always there to make you feel like everything's okay when things are just going wrong all around you, and it's said in a very simple tone. Um, with a nice melody, you don't need an overpowering, you know, percussion or anything in this particular song. Um, so it's a very delicate one. And I think that's why I really fell in love with it when I heard it. That is amazing, too. And if you don't mind, maybe you can sing a verse or two from uh, Medicine. And if you have a guitar, that's great. If not, go ahead and uh, sing a cappella. So i love to hear it. <laughs> uh, sure, I can sing it. I don't have any music right now, but I can do a little a cappella of it for you. That'd be great. 
<laughs> a shiver on my skin, the weakness calls again. Even the morning sun feels cold. My hands can't hold a prayer. Feels like no one's there. And I can't shake this feeling of alone. Here you come. You bring me your healing love. Like a pillar that made my tongue. I know it won't be long In no time at all I'll be okay again Baby, you're my medicine How's that? That is amazing. <laughs> Love it. Oh, man, that's Thank my you. medicine right there. <laughs> that is my medicine. And, of course, um, I just have another question as well, too. Um, any plans sure. for an upcoming tour um, promoting your album and single? <sighs> Absolutely. Um, I really wanted to start gaining a fan base. I wanted to start really showing who I was and what my music was all about before I put something together. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, the release of the album, I think, is going to be followed with, you know, an upcoming tour uh, once that's all kind of set in stone. Okay. And then we be going by yourself or we be opening for somebody. What's what's the plan for that? Uh, you know what? I'm not really sure. I've been thinking about a lot of different options. Um, I would certainly love to do an opening for somebody, um, but I would also like to start with maybe some smaller shows too, just to kind of, you know, get my name out there. But I'm I'm open to either way. I'm looking at a lot of different options. That is amazing too. And um, speaking of concerts as well too, and touring, what what's your what's your favorite concert um, while you're growing up and in being involved in music? What's your favorite concert you've been to? <laughs> That's a tough one. Um, so I've really enjoyed my time uh, for a CMA Fest down in Nashville. Of course, that's um, a million concerts in one. <laughs> uh -huh. um, you know, so that was a lot of fun. I had a recent experience uh, at this point. It was probably over six months ago. Um, but I saw Leanne Rimes. Uh, she was in a smaller theater. Mm -hmm. um, and to be honest with her voice, she did a rendition of, what was it? I think it was Amazing Grace. Wow. And she did not even need a microphone <laughs> for that specific song, just the acoustics in the building. Um, but we had front row seats, and it was just such a breathtaking show. It was just her and her guitarist. Um, and it was one of my favorites that I've ever been to. It was just very intimate. Mm -hmm. That is something, too. And I've never seen anybody you know, not need a microphone and belt out such a song. I mean, my <laughs> gosh, she's known for that. And if you could meet, play a gig, or write a song, have dinner, have a drink, or go party, whether whatever, with uh, any band or artist, dead or alive, who would that be and why? Um, I think depending on the day and how I feel, my answer might change. But <laughs> um, lately, it's from Miranda Lambert. Um, she's just had such a success. She worked very hard to get to where she is, spent a lot of time in the business and just her attitude is so unique you know she's herself she don't care what anyone thinks and she don't let the business change her it seems mm -hmm. and i think i could learn a lot from somebody who's been in the business for so long and just keeps such a um you know a persona about her uh, i think she's cool <laughs> that, oh it's amazing and uh, maybe one day you can uh, sing with her one day what do you think yeah, that would be awesome. Uh, between her and Pistol Annie's, I, I love their music. I do a lot of their covers um, when I do shows, so I think that would be a perfect fit. Mm, that would be something, too. And, uh, and, of course, we just have a few more pointers to discuss as well, too. Coming up, you listen to The Mike Wagner Show at themikewagnershow.com, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. Look at a professional website without breaking your budget. Sonic Web Studios is the answer. Sonic Web Studios offers fast, affordable, custom web designs that blow the competition away. Call today at 1-800-303-3960. That's 1-800-303-3960. Or email to support at sonicwebstudios.com. Mention the Mike Wagner Show. Get 10% off your first order. Sonic Web Studios. Take your image to the next level. Also, the Mike Wagner Show can be heard on the themikewagnershow.com. You can check our Facebook page at facebook.com slash themikewagnershow. You can download and listen on Facebook, SoundCloud, Spreaker, Spotify, and iHeartRadio. Also on Anchor FM, Radio Public, iTunes, Google Play, and Apple. Also take the Mike Wagner Show with you on any mobile device. And coming soon, the Mike Wagner Show will be on Stitcher and... 
You can also subscribe to the Mike Wagner Show on the YouTube channel. We're here with country singer Ashley Puckett, born and raised outside Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Began singing at a young age, star guitar at the age of 16. And she's got uh, a soon-to-be-released um, album coming out called Never Say Never on MTS Records. And the she, you also heard a little bit of Medicine featuring um, her soon-to-be hit single. And, you know, just a few more questions before we wrap up. And we know you're very busy, but we appreciate you taking the time and looking forward to having you again soon. What do you consider your most favorite project and the most challenging? Um, I would say the most challenging is probably um, in, in the music business writing. Um, I get some writing moments to where I can finish a song in an hour. And I get some that I still have unfinished from, you know, over a year and a half from now. Um, so I think that's, a, you know, a, a challenge for me sometimes. I don't like to sit and write if it's not really coming from the heart. I'm really particular with what, you know, what I put on paper. And um, something that's been um, pretty easy for me, uh, I think going through the recording process um, in this album, uh, it took over a year, a little over a year to get everything um, prepared. And I think I learned a lot about myself. So I think moving forward, um, the easy thing for me is really, I think showing who I am in my music and um, just my sound to be unique. That is amazing, too. And uh, what's your most memorable moment? Um, honestly, there's been so many. Um, I've met a lot of great people throughout this, you know, this past year and a half. And I think just a lot of the studio time and a lot of the good vibes that we were able to do um, between me um, the guys, the musicians, uh, I think, you know, there's a lot of memories there that I'll, I'll never forget. Mm, that is amazing. And who do you consider biggest influence in your career? Um, there's a few. Um, my fiance has always been there for me. Um, you know, a lot of this is possible, you know, because he just stands behind me. He gives me that little uh, push every time I need it. Uh, my parents have always been there and, uh, you know, lately, uh, myself, too, I think we don't give ourselves credit enough. But, uh, you know, I've, I fell into some times in my life when I wasn't really putting music first. And uh, I think sometimes it's just ourselves that need to push our, you know, ourselves forward a little bit. So <laughs> mm-hmm. that that is something, too. And I have to be amazed by that. And what's the best advice you can give to anybody at this point? My best advice is don't lose track of what you want. You know, life's going to throw you in a lot of different directions, and that's in any career. That's in anything that you want to strive for. Um, it's really just um, keeping your eye on what you want and surrounding your people with, surrounding yourself with the right people. Mm, that is fantastic. And uh, Ashley, just want to say a big thank you for your time. Looking forward to having you again soon. Once again, country singer Ashley Puckett, um, born and raised outside Pittsburgh, PA, with um, her new single and album. Once again, tell us about your upcoming projects, your website, how the people contact you, and where can they find your music? Yes, uh, you can find my music anywhere you like to listen on uh, all the platforms. So um, Pandora, Spotify, YouTube, um, iTunes, Apple Music, Amazon. Uh, my website is the best place to keep up with me. It is just ashleypuckett.com. I'm also um, heavily addicted to Facebook, so you can find a lot of my stuff uh, firsthand on Facebook. Um, so I have a page there, just Ashley Puckett Music. And uh, a lot of upcoming stuff. Um, you know, like I mentioned earlier, um, you know, a tour, obviously the big CD release. So um, for all the dates and everything coming, um, just follow me, say hi, and uh, let's be friends. <laughs> Sounds great. Ashley, just want to say a big thank you for your time. You've been fantastic. Look forward to having you again soon. And do us a favor. Keep us up to date. Sounds great. Thank you very much for having me. It's been a pleasure. Thanks for listening to The Mike Wagner Show, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. Listen online at themikewagnershow.com and on Facebook, SoundCloud, Spreaker, Spotify, and iHeartRadio. And watch the interview on YouTube. Also, become a sponsor of the program and or donate today at themikewagnershow.com. Join us again tomorrow for another episode of The Mike Wagner Show.